built uh, a couple companies. His main company is a uh, trucking company, M&M Transport, and the other ones have kind of stemmed off of that. But yeah, he uh, he built it from the ground up from one truck. Um, and now he's got a fleet of, I think, you know, over 500. It's all across the country. So uh, I think we definitely get that work ethic from him. Um, our other two older brothers are involved in the company. We've obviously chosen a different path, but um, you know, just to see how much work he's put in and still puts in to this day, um, you know, kind of keeps us humble and it keeps us on track to, uh, you know, take that into our careers and, you know, keep pushing forward. Um, I think you might like it more than us. Yeah, <laughs> um, yeah he loves it. It's, um, I think it's an escape from him, from his business and what he does on a day-to-day -day basis. So for him to come to the rink um, and watch him or, or come to our game when we were in Charlotte, he'd come once a month to watch games. I think he still gets that same joy even though I'm not playing. Uh, so this is obviously a thrill for him. Uh, on a normal year, it'd be even better, but um, I think he's enjoying that we're kind of together in, in a way. I mean, he'll claim he played when he was younger, but I don't know if he was much of a hockey player. I think he was pretty good at baseball back in the day, but I don't know. We had neighbors growing up who uh, played hockey, and then um, our older brothers started playing, and we kind of just, one of those things that you want to do what your brothers do, kind of just kept getting passed on. We've had, so it was four of us total, so we've had two on two fo football games. We usually go on a family vacation every summer. Um, what else have we done? Spike, spike ball. Spike ball, or even like golf, or pool volleyball. And yeah, this summer was pool volleyball. And it starts off very calm, and it's just a calm, but for whatever reason, it builds into, let's have one more game, let's have another game. And by the end of that, it's usually in a, some type of argument or fight, mom and dad yelling at us, wives yelling at us, so. I mean, I think they know it's all in good fun, but I just think, uh, you know, when you're athletes and you have that competitive side, you kind of take that into whatever you do. I mean, yeah, definitely him. And it's usually me and him as their partners or teammates or whatever, so. I mean, he likes to win and, uh, you know, he doesn't want to stop until he wins. Always, I think like a couple years ago, we had a backyard football game down in South Carolina and it got a little aggressive, but it was him and I and, and our two older brothers from prior. And our oldest brother isn't in the greatest shape and they beat us, so we heard it for the rest of the, the, rest of the trip. Probably him, I'm a bit faster than him, so I'm more of a wide receiver type. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you always start off with you're gonna, you know, play flag football or something, but by the end of the day, it's getting physical and, uh, I don't know, I think it's just our competitive nature and you get four brothers together that all wanna win and kinda takes directions that you, you weren't really thinking were gonna happen. Thank you.